What's up, everybody? My name is Tyler Schmidt. I'm here in uh, here in Manhattan. It's a nice, beautiful, sunny day outside. I'm a little sweaty. I just played some basketball. Got my day going the right way. Appreciate you guys taking the time to listen. I know there's probably a lot of other more fun things you could be doing and hear me blabber on, but just wanted to give a little background on who I am and what I do, and if I can, you know, help help one of, one of you students think about things a little bit differently, I think that that would be a win. So I grew up, uh, I grew up in Montclair, New Jersey. Grew up with Calvin, who, uh, who asked me to make this video. And, uh, and I currently work in media. Um, I work in media and production. And so I think growing up, you realize you, there's media everywhere around you, whether it's the cartoon that you're watching, um, on Saturday morning and the commercial that comes on, whether it's uh, the new t-shirt that you just got um, with your favorite movie character on it, or your Iron Man lunchbox. You know, a lot of that is media. And what is cool is that I think a lot of people don't necessarily realize that that's an entire industry. You know, how, does a company like General Mills get your caregiver or brother or mother or father to buy the Trix cereal or the Trix yogurt? And why did they buy Trix instead of Captain Crunch? Um, and that's what I do. I work uh, in helping brands acquire customers. Uh, why did you buy the notebook that you bought? when you wanted to go back to school. Um, and the way that I got into that was just by being, really having a lot of different interests and being incredibly curious about things. Um, I think I was always into art and brand and sports and uh, the why behind things. I was never that great at math or history or social studies or um, art class or really you know reading and literature i wasn't good at any of them i was not a good student but what i was was always very curious i always asked a lot of questions and then when i was interested in something i would ask more questions and kind of follow and stay down that path i think if you follow what you enjoy as much as possible you will be successful because it is very tough growing up as a, as a kid, um, you've getting a lot thrown at you and a lot of told by others of what you are good at and what you're not good at. And that might not necessarily be what you enjoy. Um, if you get a C in history or you didn't want to do your homework, that doesn't mean you're not going to be successful. But what is a major factor is things like being nice to people, being nice to the people around you, getting to know the people around you, caring for the people around you. Those are the things that make people successful. And it's not cool to be mean. I think that there's a big stigma that it's very cool to be mean, but it's not. And so back to a little bit of what I do in terms of media, um, it's always changing. When I was in fourth grade, when I was in fifth grade, there was no such thing as an iPhone. It didn't exist. And I'm very young. I'm 27. And so we don't know what's going to happen. We don't know where everything's going to go. We don't know what the Xbox is going to look like in 10 years or PlayStation or Apple TV or the NBA. But I do know that it's going to change. And I do know that they're going to need young people that understand the change because they were interested in it and curious. And the people that are willing to work hard and be nice and be curious are the ones that are going to be successful. And so that's my little rant. And that's what's on my mind. And I hope I get to meet you all one day. And talk soon. Have a great weekend.